Okay, guys. I haven't filmed a long time on my channel, but let's just not worry about that. I am doing the JJ Smith Detox Smoothie, Green Smoothie Cleanse. And so I wanted to show you preparation and me making my smoothies for day three. So the ingredients that you need for day three are two packs of stevia. You'll need two cups of water. So I just have an unopened bottle of water. You'll need spinach and spring mix. You'll need some flax seeds, ground flax seeds, frozen blueberries, frozen strawberries, and apples. And I have some apples and then I, I'm just using my Ninja. So I have a big thing of apples. And you have to use two apples cored. So let's just get right into it. So I've rinsed and cleaned my Ninja. And because I don't have like a Vita Vitamix or any one of those high powered mixers, I just have this Ninja. I go ahead and add my two cups of water and my greens. So it calls for two big bunches of spinach and one bunch of spring mix, spring mix, which is right here. And I'm gonna open it up. I have my um, ball jars. I ordered some jars from Amazon and surprisingly the, the mail carrier delivered it to the wrong house. And so, yeah, that's that. Now I'm gonna use my measuring cup, measure out two cups of water, and then I'm going to mix. I've added my greens and my two cups of water. And now I put my blender on crush instead of blend, just to kind of chop up that, that spinach leaf really, really good, because you don't want to be, she does advise that you chew your smoothie, but you don't want to actually be chewing the leaves. So that I want it to be really fine and ground up really good. So I push crush. So now you're supposed to add one banana peel. So I'm gonna add the banana. Two apples, cored and cut, quartered. So I did that. You want one and a half cups of frozen strawberries and no blueberries. So I don't know why I have the blueberries. So one and a half cups of strawberries. So here's the strawberries. And then two packs of stevia. I'm using the pure organic stevia packs. Two ground tablespoons of flaxseed and I have my measuring cups on hand. And then I'm going to then hit blend. So it was one and a half cups of blueberries and no strawberries called appleberry so my mistake so no strawberries but add blueberries okay guys I added my two tablespoons of ground flaxseed one my one package of stevia my one and a half cups of blueberries and now I'm going to blend all this together and then I'll show you what it looks like all blended up and poured up and sealed off in one of my ball jars that does not cause it to separate so I'll make it the night before and it does not separate in the morning all right so I'm all done blending it all and I'm just gonna pour it up and it makes three servings if you make it right hey guys here's the final product three berry smoothies what's today's name it's called appleberry so that's why it's kind of dark, opposed to like some of the greener ones that we've had the previous two days. It is um, kind of dark. So these are pint-sized jars, so I, I figure it's about 12, between 12 and 16 ounces. I just try to make them evenly, even rather, like the amounts that I pour in to make three servings. So yeah, I was gonna come on here and talk to you guys about how it's been going. I'll do that in the next video. Thanks for watching.